And that boy, he was fat. He was a boy and he was fat. And he, I think he smacked me in my, my arm. He smacked, he hit me. So I got up and I punched him. I punched him, don't hit me. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Hold on. Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today, I'm going to be doing a story time on how this big fat boy punched me in my face. Hmm. But before we get into this video, make sure you like, comment, and subscribe to my channel and comment down below any other videos you want me to do. And if you see I have the same shirt on, same hair and everything as my last video, I recorded this the same day, like literally two seconds after I recorded the other one. So, yeah. So this happened when I was in fourth grade. I'm in 10th right now. So this happened, fifth, six, seven, nine. This happened six years ago. Dang. This happened when I was in fourth grade. I was living in New York, still, and everything. And I went. I was going. I went to a charter school because before I went, I went to a pub, public school. But then I switched and went to a charter school for a year, and I went right back to a public school after that one year because I was not doing it. So fourth, my fourth grade year, I was in a charter school, and it was strict. Not well, yeah. So basically. First, for me and this, I don't even know whose name. I'm going to name him Idiot because he's an idiot. So, me and Idiot never liked each other. Like, I always had a problem with him. Like, he was just mad big and doofy. Like, he was mad annoying. I, I never liked him. And did I have a... Yeah, I never even had a class with him. I think he was a grade older than me. I think he was in fifth grade. I think he was in fifth and I was in fourth. And mind you, we had a little sister that was like a midget. She was like in second grade, but she was like, I don't know, but her his little sister had like, I think, no, actually it was his niece, his niece. I mean, this, and his niece went to the same school and she was like, she was like in third grade, but she was so tiny, like she was tiny and people used to make fun of her, stuff like that, like she was tiny. But, um, yeah, so me and I never liked Idiot. So we ride the same bus. So me and me, all my friends, Prince, my brother, he's we he was in I was in fourth, he was in second grade. So Prince was in second grade and I was in fourth grade and the idiot was in fifth. And me and Prince rode the same bus because we went to the same school. Yeah, because we're two years apart. So we went to the same school, we rode the same bus and everything. So we that bus used to be Liddy for the city. We used to play tag on the bus, we used to play hide and seek, we used to play cops and robbers, we used to play Everything. We used to hop over the seats. We used to go under the seats. Like, we was bad. That bus was was always turned. Like, we was always having fun on that bus. And I remember we got caught, and then we got ISS and stuff. But, yeah, that bus was always fun. But, yeah, so we was always playing stuff. We was always playing around on the bus and everything. So, Idiot had this paper airplane. He made... He was like, do you like my paper airplane? I was like, no, like it's a paper airplane. Everybody can make that. He was flying it around, flying into my face. I'm like, can you move? Like, I don't, I don't, like, I don't care. Like, move. Idiot would not stop. Like, he would keep throwing it at my face. And I was like, do it again. I'm gonna throw it out the window. Like, I was like, keep putting that paper airplane in my face. I'm throwing it out the window. And he, and he thought I was playing. So he threw it in my face and everything. I ripped that paper airplane and I threw it out the window. Like, why are you putting that in my face? So I threw it out the window because he was on the bus. So that went right out the window. And then <clears throat> after he got mad that I threw his thing out the window. So we, then he hit me. I think he smacked, smacked me. And I don't care if you're if you if you a girl, you a boy, you big, you small, you fat. Bro, I'm just, I'm, I, like. And that boy, he was fat. He was a boy and he was fat. And he, I think he smacked me in my, my arm. He smacked, he hit me. So I got up and I punched him. I punched him, don't hit me. Like, don't hit me. So I punched him. Then after, he got up and then we started fighting. So me and that fat boy was literally fighting. Like, bro. So after uh, we started fighting and all that. And mind you, I was literally, I was winning. Like, I was punch I was doing everything. Like, I don't care if he was big, but I was still doing what I had to do, and I won. 
well I, my opinion not one but as he was fighting and stuff and um then he punched me in my face like i thought he was just like you know but i didn't think he was hitting me as hard as he would hit a boy but he was really fighting me like i was a dude so that's what made me get more aggressive and start hitting him like 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 so i was really fighting him like me and that dude was really fighting and he punched me in my face so i did i had a pencil because we just came from school so i had a pencil and i stabbed him with the pencil and um yeah so that after after i stabbed him in the leg with the pencil i think i stabbed him in the leg or i stabbed him in the um the stomach one of those but after that um after that then he stopped so then after then we stopped fighting and then there was this bus driver the bus driver was just sitting there eating chinese food like the bus driver didn't even do anything so um after the after the after the fight happened i went to the bus driver i went to go tell the bus driver he didn't even care he was eating his food and wasn't paying attention so he just let us fight then um after that prince and his other friends were just sitting there and um prince was just watching the fight happen he didn't do nothing he just watched me and that boy fight and didn't do nothing and his excuse was he was scared of the boy because the boy was bigger than him the boy wasn't that big but still <clears throat> the boy he prince didn't do nothing he just sat there and watched me fight the boy and so after i came home and i told my mom and everybody and then she was asking me if prince helped now i lied and said that he did help and he never helped he was just sitting and looking stupid so but because she was like um if he didn't help he's gonna be in or something so i was like um yeah he helped and i made up a story saying how he um he she was like so what did he do and i was like uh i was he was kicking him he was punching him and i got the other how i got the other arms so that i was making up lies but he sat there and watched the whole time he didn't help so after the fight ended i told the bus driver he didn't care so i got off the bus because it was my stop and then Miss um the the daycare teacher, she usually picks us up from the bus stop and she walks us back to the daycare. So she asked, so I was mad because something she, so she knew something that was wrong with me. So she was like, What happened? So I told her what happened. So she went to the daycare, she told the um owner of the daycare, then they called my mom and then um yeah, so after I guess she called the school and now he had what did he get? I think he got ISS or he got suspended for like two days and then he got ISS for three days. But yeah, so after that, we haven't, after he came from his suspension, we never talked, we never did nothing. And then like a month later, we started talking again. But, um, yeah, so that's how I got, um, so yeah. So basically, that's how I got punched in the face by this fat dude. And yeah, but that was actually like my fourth fight. Like I was, I, bro, I got in a lot of fights, but that was my first fight with a boy. And one, even though he punched me in my face, I still won because I stabbed him with the pencil. And Prince just sat there and watched, and he did do he didn't do not nothing. And I lied and said he'd help, and he didn't help. He didn't do nothing. He watched. But, yeah, the more moral of the story is, actually, there's no moral of the story. But, yeah. But this was the end of the video. I can't believe I fought a dude. Like, bro, I would actually fight a dude. And he was mad. He was fat. Like he was so big. But yeah. But this is the end of the video. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe, and comment down below your thoughts on this story time. But yeah. Now see you guys in my next video. Bye guys. Oh, this is in perfect lighting. I should have the video in this light. But bye guys. Yeah. 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 Yeah.